Hi friends, Mike Smith here, Senior Minister of Minchabri Anglican Church. It's Friday, which means it's church news time for another week. And we're into the month of November. It is recharge season as a church. And, and last weekend, I introduced you to one of our uh, particular fundraising goals that we have during the recharge season each year. Uh, and that is our Minchinbury 25 Building Fund fundraising goal. Uh, we hope to raise $25,000 each year until 2025, uh, hopefully to raise up enough capital that we might be able to see a, a broader vision for our church properties, uh, our properties being enhanced uh, for the mission of Jesus. Uh, we've raised almost $85,000 over the last few years into that building fund and wouldn't it be great to see that go over $100,000 uh, this year? So can I commend that uh, goal to you uh, this recharge season? And it's not just a rainy day fund, a pie in the sky uh, dream that we have. Uh, I introduce you to the greenhouse development uh, idea that Parish Council has been uh, reflecting on over the last few years. The greenhouse, which is uh, right here behind me, we'd love to see that site developed. Maybe put three dwellings on there, which we can uh, use to house our ministry staff. We could uh, have an income stream to provide for ministry going forward. Uh, it is a wonderful opportunity. So let me again commend the Minchinbury 25 uh, Building Fund this uh, recharge season. Now this Sunday, we're continuing our journey through the New Testament book of Acts, and we're in Acts chapter 25 and 26. Uh, Paul now appears before another Roman governor. This time it is Festus and he also gets an audience with the king of the Jews, uh, Agrippa. Now when it comes to sharing our faith in a public forum, we can all find it a bit of a daunting uh, experience. Uh, we don't want to be like those that we have seen make an absolute mess of it. And maybe we're threatened by those who seem to be able to do it effortlessly and winsomely. But there is much that we can all learn about sharing our faith in a public uh, forum. And we're going to look at the example of the Apostle Paul in Acts and, and hopefully we'll be greatly encouraged. We can all be faithful witnesses wherever God uh, places us. So look forward to that this uh, coming Sunday, 10 a.m. Uh, or 6 p.m. Now, at the end of the month of November, don't forget, is our Thanksgiving celebration service on Sunday, the 27th of November. We're combining our morning church, evening church. Uh, the Indigenous Church of Tregear are going to come and join us. Uh, it'll be a, a morning service, 10 a.m., a great opportunity to celebrate and give thanks to God for his provision uh, of us this uh, last 12 months. So look forward to that on Sunday, the 27th of November. Uh, ladies, don't forget that the next women's event is coming up on Saturday, the 26th of November, Rest in a Restless World. You can register uh, for that event using the link in the description box below. And one other event for your calendar, again on Saturday, the 26th of November, but this time in the morning will be our next Working Bee. And that'll be a great opportunity uh, to come together to make our site look as best that it can be both for the women's event that evening, but also for the Thanksgiving service, uh, which would be the very next day on the 27th of November. So friends, that's all the news from me for today. Have a wonderful weekend and look forward to gathering with you, singing God's praise, encouraging each other and gathering around the word this Sunday. God bless.